Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I just come to you today, <clears throat> you know, to make a special announcement to the world, to the universal world, the new world that we in right now. Uh, this is uh, me, King Jesus, uh, ladies and gentlemen, and today I'm coming to demonstrate to you uh, the big natural disaster that happens over there in Japan where they had an earthquake and a then it turned into a tsunami. If you look on your TVs today, listen on the news, you see it, 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 it happened. Uh, it's a great disaster. Nuclear plants blowing up. Uh, you know, things are falling, you know what I'm saying, <clears throat> through the laws of nature. Uh, that's why I come today, ladies and gentlemen, to let you know that that great event that happened over there in Japan is 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 signaling a new day on this earth you know that was like the sign from nature you know because mother nature controls everything man don't control nothing it's mother nature that controls everything on earth whether it's nuclear powers or what you see it if you turn on your tv today that uh nuclear powers are no match for mother nature and that's who got my back King Jesus right here live and direct in this new world. I'm coming to y'all uh, to explain that <clears throat> that great event happened is the earth shifted or the pole shifted to to cause uh, uh, that sudden reaction, that earthquake or that tsunami at the same time because as the earth shifts, uh, because she, as the earth shifts, because she's aligning herself uh, with the sun in this day and time, ladies and gentlemen, uh, and, and, and by her aligning herself with the sun, she, 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 she makes certain shifts, uh, on the earth to, to adjust herself for the sun's planetary influence, ladies and gentlemen, uh, she will continue to adjust herself, uh, ladies and gentlemen of the world uh because we are in these days and time where you know that the sun is really taking effect on the earth because you see now technology wise everything is digital uh these are the powers that the sun bring in this day and time uh in this new generation or this new world that people talk about every day uh that is what's happening on the every day uh far as like uh, uh what the causes and effects of the tsunamis and the earthquakes and the hurricanes and the tornadoes you know these natural disasters and natural catastrophes of the earth ladies and gentlemen these are things that supposed to happen to mother nature or mother earth as she's aligned herself up with the sun ladies and gentlemen we are in basically like the days of fire and uh, I just have a little information for the world, you know, just just to let everyone know and, and, and understand what time of day we are in and what happened over there in Japan, the cause and effect that Mother Nature brings. King Jesus coming to you live and direct. Mother Nature has my back. She's telling me to reveal these things to y'all, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, her force is my force because I deal with the laws of nature and I'm getting ready to explain why. Uh, these things are happening on earth, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, here. It's a piece of paper I got here. Some information, good information for this day and time so everybody can, like, know and understand what's going on. Okay, like, in this day and time, uh, if we calculate the motion of the North Pole from the period of its being perpendicular, that means vertical, to the coinciding with the North Pole of the Sun, over the distance of 90 degrees, when it would be horizontal or in the plane of its orbit, we shall obtain four dis distinct periods. Oh, I'm going to read that once again, ladies and gentlemen, so you can understand. If we calculate the motion of the North Pole from the period of its being perpendicular, that means vertical, to, the, to and coinciding with the North Pole of the Sun over a distance of 90 degrees, when it would be horizontal or in the plane of its orbit, we shall obtain four distinct periods. What they mean by four distinct periods is like uh, as the earth shifts or as the north pole or as the earth poles shift, you know, uh, they shift into different distinct periods on earth. You know, the fire period, the, 
the water period, the earth period, and you know, you know, periods like these. It's four distinct periods that 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 you know that Mother Nature brings on Earth. In this day and time, she's bringing like the fire period because she's aligning or adjusting herself with the uh, planetary fluence of the sun in this day and time, ladies and gentlemen. That's why you see the Earth. Uh, when she makes certain shifts, especially like over there in Japan, because Japan is like over there in the middle of water, and, and as the ocean beds shift in the ocean, it causes earthquakes and great tsunamis because because when she tilt, she shifts. You know, ocean beds shift. Ocean beds shift. So she while Japan is in the water. If you go to a mountain, you see Japan is in, in, in like the island in the middle of the water. So when that ocean bed shift, it created that great disaster or uh, natural disaster on Earth in this day and time. But that will, things like that happens in these days and times, ladies and gentlemen. I'm just uh, coming to you live and direct, you know, so just to explain some of these things to you. Uh, I got some more information too, like... Uh, right here <clears throat> okay i just explained the four distinct periods okay <clears throat> during the passes of these four distinct periods uh, of the pole from one point of the quadrant that means an arc of 90 degrees you know like a 90 degree angle you know that's how the pole shift like in 90 degree angles uh it, it occurs the four mystical ages which also correspond to fire air water and earth like i explained to you these what this is what mother nature governs by she governs by the fire period the uh, air period the water period and the earth period ladies and gentlemen and these periods would be found to differ by 64,800 years see it takes these periods or life cycles just to to follow through uh, their periods on as Mother Nature or as Mother Earth, uh, you know, uh, uh, orbits around, you know, the uh, the solar system or you know the universe, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, you know that's what they govern sixty four thousand eight hundred years, and we are like in the year of the fire. See, well, right here, ladies and gentlemen. The first is the Golden Age, <clears throat> which begin with a most delightful climate, a gentle, fruitful, universal summer. Like over here in the Western Hemisphere, as we come into uh, the ruling of the sun, which they call the global warming, but it's like really the ruling of the sun, uh, when we have a delightful, fruitful, fruitful uh, summer like this speaks of. And, and this ancient seat of science was indeed divinely favored by the laws of nature throughout long ages. And no wonder it was Christian, the golden age, which corresponds to fire. Uh, you know, like in California, they had the fires, the wildfires. You see like wildfires now over here in the Western Hemisphere, like where we had uh, <clears throat> these the sun's influence bring these type of things to earth, ladies and gentlemen. You know, uh, it brings a delightful, fruitful, fruitful event on earth. And in, 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 in this correspondence, like in the laws of nature, is fire. So, you know, when you see these things on TV about great wildfires in Colorado, and, uh, Phoenix, or, you know, California, the great plain regions, these are, you know, the... The influence from the sun, its vertical rays cause these fires. So that makes us like in a golden age. And, uh, you know, ladies and gentlemen, so, you know, I'm going to read that one more time. The first is the golden age, which begin with a most delightful climate, a gentle, fruitful, universal summer. This ancient seat of science was indeed divinely favored by the laws of nature. Throughout the long ages, and no wonder it was Christian the Golden Age, which corresponds to fire. See, the laws of nature, core, when you're dealing with the laws of nature and things in that nature, you deal with, you know, elements of the earth. And, and right now, the fire element is on the earth, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, you see that Mother Nature is presenting herself to the world, causing the tension to let King Jesus, which is me, come to y'all and explain these things, you know. And what in the events that's happening, you know, and that was a great catastrophe, you know, for the people to really wake up and understand, you know, uh, 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 that Mother Nature 
overcomes everything, you know. Everybody arms too short to box with Mother the Nature, ladies and gentlemen. And, and the Mother Nature has my back because I I am one with Mother Nature, King Jesus. And and you see, she draw attention to the earth so I can bring these sciences, ladies and, um, and gentlemen. See, King Jesus is really here, you know, in this day and time. You know, do these drastic changes that the earth is going to present uh, over the next courses of years. So... You know, I just wanted to bring that to the people, you know, to the world in this day and time as they seen the natural disaster, you know, from Mother Nature and seeing how nuclear and all these things that man made is 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 is, is obsolete when it comes to Mother Nature. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, you know, the people in China, everybody's back in heaven. You know, Mother Nature presents these things for people to, you know, just to just to. Uh, sit back and you know see how strong mother nature is but everybody whose bodies they find over there they are in heaven spiritual heaven or back into the universe because mother nature comes like that she takes out a whole bunch of things and causes disasters for people can really to wake up to have her children on earth to bring certain type of things so until next time ladies and gentlemen it's king jesus